Hey, what's going on guys? Running with God976 here and we are back with some more Final Fantasy 15. We left off last time. We finally discovered where the Regalia is at. Now we're gonna infiltrate the base where is being out at. First thing though, we gotta go ahead and camp and figure out what exactly our plans about that are going to be. And you saw we got a new training for uh out under the stars tonight. We got a new training available right there. We're not going to do that quite yet. We'll do that at some other point. But for the time being, let's figure out what we're going to do. But of course, we got to cook with Ignis first. Now, there are a lot of new recipes. I already know which one I'm going to use as this is honestly the second time that I have recorded this episode. <laughs> Last time, it kind of just bunked out on me. Um about halfway through the video I, I was I was so upset um I believe it was this one yes 300 attack yeah okay this is it um and before we get too far into this guys I uh I got one thing I would really like to say so my uncle Mike he passed away last night um, I don't want to make this video all about that. I don't want to make this video sad or anything because of that. I'm going to do my best to stay strong and, you know, not let it affect me. But, you know, I will say I was, pl I, I, I play music a little bit, not too much, and I was planning on playing um, the one song that I have written uh, for him the, not I didn't write the song for him but I, I wrote the song I, I wanted to play the song for him and uh, he ended up passing away before I could have a chance to go and do that um, so I do feel a little bad about that um, I just want y'all to know if you happen to be in a dark place or you happen to be going through a tough time or you have lost uh, someone you're close to just know that their suffering is done and they're in a better place now the title of my song was called keep holding on it's a it's a Christian song um, this is a big part of the reason I wanted to play it for him you know he was he was getting himself he, he's Christian as well he was getting himself ready prepped and ready to head up there and Not meet bad. with our Creator and now he is now I I'm sure that he is having a really good time up there I'm just Stylish as always. a little sad that I didn't get to you know actually play this song for him it, it, it it's a really good song I feel like um, I'm not gonna sing the whole song or anything I'm not gonna sing any of the song actually if y'all would happen to want to hear it uh, you could go to my personal page, um, my personal YouTube page, I'm pretty sure I have it on there. Uh, I played that a while back. Um, it's Kindle Dolis, that, that, that's my real name, uh, K-E-N-D-A-L-L-D-O-L-E-S-E. -L -L -E -E. I really shouldn't give out that info, but in this situation, I feel like it's it's the right thing to do. So yeah, if y'all want to hear that song, go ahead and go over there. Anyways, we'll take it. let's Maybe move I on living out of this. and uh, figure Perfect out timing. all these photos we're going to save. I, I said I wasn't going to make it all sad and everything, so I need to move on. Um, that looks really good right there, so let's go ahead and save that. Um, yes, definitely have to save that one. Hey. This one's pretty good. I know. 
too. Good photo of a tail. We don't even exactly know what kind of monster that is. I'm sure I'll find out, but whew, honestly, off the top of my head, I cannot think what that it could be. <laughs> Anyways, let's move on ahead. But yeah, guys, if, uh... So many bright ideas, Ignis? Let me just this guy's first. As it were, a frontal assault would leave us exposed. But if we move under cover of night, we might be able to infiltrate the base unnoticed. And until then, we learn all we can about the base's design and attempt to narrow down the Regalia's location. I'll analyze what intelligence we have available to find us a way in. Sounds good, Specs. All right, we're gonna get our wheels back. Let's get going. But yeah, guys, if you if you could just maybe say a quick prayer, pray for your loved ones, pray for yourself. That would bring some. That would that would be really good for my uncle. He he would he would have loved that. I greatly appreciate that as well. The last thing we want is to engage an entire garrison. Avoid detection at all costs. In and out before it gets light, then. Indeed. Even if it means leaving the task unfinished, we withdraw before we overstay our welcome. Alright, so let's get this operation underway. So yeah, you're, you're going to want to sneak a little bit. Together on my signal. Until then, hold position. Three, two, one. And get interrupted. <laughs> yes, while infiltrating the base, Noctis can take down foes with a warp kill. So that's most of what we're going to be doing. We're going to be warp killing a lot of these guys. see yeah it's just an easy quick uh, kill that's all it takes and You're success keep it up you don't have to do that actually you can just fight them regularly oh, we're not gonna I'm gonna go ahead and go to the side and see oh, it forces you to go over here stop what side lights we're clear tread warily Yes, yeah, so you don't. Um, you ca you kind of have to go through the these parts right here. Hey. But whenever it comes to warp killing those guys, you don't have to be super sneaky about it. You can get caught. It's not a big deal. You'll just fight them like regular after that. Take cover. And how exactly does the thing not see him with his head poking out over the boxes like that? And now watch. Ignis is going to stand straight up when those guys were walking straight this way yet they can't see us that makes sense right <laughs> video game logic <laughs> not the first time oh you can't go up here is there anything back there no alright that was a waste of time eh, I guess it's not it's always good to see if Target the blind spot. you can find hit, more items kill. Can't even warp kill him. What? Let me warp kill him. That was weird. Oh man. I forgot he was. Oh! I didn't even see this guy, honestly. So, yeah, anytime if you get caught, no big deal. You just you lose out on that AP. But, yeah, you can just go ahead and kill them real quick. Nothing really changes from there. And after that, you're going to want to go into the spotlight after they told you not to be in the spotlight. And <laughs> open up this gate. This will move us forward, and we will see what is on this the other side. The base? Excuse me. A Magitech generator of some description. It would explain why the troopers in the vicinity are uncommonly strong. 
I say we wreck it. Spare us the sneaking around. The risk is too great. Finding the regalia comes fast. Not a sound. You'll allow the anime. Got it. Not the sound. As he makes sounds. Now, I really don't care to wait for all this, so I'm just going to go into it. Huh, maybe I actually can't get them. Now, where are the others? I'm actually going to get them, aren't I? Huh. I've actually never done that one without getting caught. Right. Well. Uh, might still be hope for you. And it puts us right in front of this other gate. I was pleasantly surprised with that. Nice. And alright. There's the quest marker, and there is the regalia. There's the old girl. She's a real sight for sore eyes. And none the worse for her tiny imperial hands. Too bad though, we got caught. <laughs> yeah, either way, we're going to need to do this. So, no big deal. We're going to just have to get these guys out of the way. We couldn't have just driven straight out, anyways, right? Well, let me attack him. Ah, quit aiming at the arms. Let's just take him out. You see, they're basically useless whenever they fall down like that. Alright. What else have we got? There you go. Oh! I've always had a problem with getting away from those explosions. Yeah. True words have not been said. No thanks, we'll just take them out by hand. Honestly, yeah, the, the, the energy tank will do a lot of damage, but you see how quick we're beating them? There's no point. You can just beat them all by hand, and it'll be alright. You'll get them all. It'll be faster this way, honestly. Alright, there we go. That should be almost all of them. We got these guys up in the uh, towers that we gotta take care of. There we go. That's, he should be the last one. Alright, there goes that. And now we'll head over to the generator and get that thing taken care of. First things first, we gotta get through this gate right here, which sends all of the gates. Same thing as always, we just gotta take these guys out real quick. And then we should be good after that. Oh, and then we got the NTs. Alright. Oh, these are NAs. My bad. My bad. I'm not perfect all the time. Sometimes I make mistakes. There we go. Now he's gone. It's not all of them, though, apparently. There we go. Got this guy just hiding over here for some reason. I'm surprised these two didn't wake up. Or that one too. Or that one too. <laughs> Each and every one of them. Why didn't they wake up on us? Yes, we can go that way. Or oh, that's where we're supposed to go. But. Ah, dang it, they saw me. Alright. So we'll go through here. Um, you don't have to go through here, it's just there's an item that I want to grab. Um, it may not even be worth it, honestly to do all this, but you know me. You know how I am with items. I want to grab them all. I must have them all. Alright, VAs, MAs. Jesus, I just can't get those right. <laughs> there we go. You're almost done. Or are you? Can I attack him? There we go. Jump! No! What are you doing? Well, I couldn't even get away from there. 
I, I really didn't know you had to fight all of these. I thought you only had to fight like three or four of them. Quit running away and let us just beat you up. Alright, you know what, Gladio finish. Cause I don't know where the other two guys are at, they're just out doing their own thing apparently. And meanwhile, Glad Did he not finish him off? With impulse? Wow, oh, that is surprising. And there's still more. Oh, I didn't know there was uh, soldiers in here. I thought it was just those machines. That should be all of them. Alright, yeah, there we go. Alright, after we beat that, we got some decent experience off of that too. We go out this back door right here. And there should be an item right here. Reflex Enhancer! Seriously? If I'd have known it was going to be something like that, I wouldn't have bothered with all this. My bad. Just a waste of time. Oh well. I may have gone the wrong way. Yeah. Can I get there through here? Yes, I can. Alright, cool. I guess I didn't waste too much time. Let's see if there's anything in here. And... new. Alright, I'm wasting time. Let's just go ahead and go get these generators taken care of. Let's get it done! And now we got us a little mini boss like usual. Oh wait, nope, it's just the MAX. I don't know why they're Can I beat that battery soldier already? What is going on? There we go. Alright. Get beat up already, dude. You're no stronger than the last one. And you're already useless, so yeah, we, we win. Haha, <laughs> we win, we lose. <laughs> oh, guys, I can finally show y'all what happens when you get to some of these guys. Let's go! I don't even care if, if he's. Okay, come on, come on. Summon. Left here. I'm pressing it. I'm pressing it. There we go. Wait, no! There we go, I guess you gotta hold it down. So this is Ramu, or Rama. Rama, there we go. And look at this epicness. Judgment bolt! The reality only has to be our Jesus And that will automatically take out anything and everything around you. Unless it's like a really big trick. Place is dead. Rest in pieces. Come on. Let's grab the regalia and split. Oh, that took the generator out too. Wow, nice. Um and yeah, it takes a bit, but the place will um piece of cake, huh? This part is. Inadvertent though it was, we dealt the Empire a crushing blow today. The Marshal will be pleased to hear of this. Yeah, the what you sweet, Shush your face! Bust a base. I like the sound of that for this sort of thing. But there's a base, we go in and bust it up. Bust a base. Whatever, I'm calling it that. You don't have to. Pronto, shut up. Don't <laughs> shut up. Why not go Oh my gosh, y'all are getting epic. annoying. Because I thought of it first. So that's the name. Bust a base. Get used to it. Easier said than done. Yes, before they start talking again, um, yeah, the area will get destroyed by ram by any of the gods that get summoned like that. But it'll it the place um the area will regenerate after a little bit. Chosen king 
Awful high and mighty for an Imperial rat. Serving the enemy to hunt down Luna. I do not serve. I command. The King's sworn shield. You better believe it. A weak shield protects not. <laughs> heavy stuff going on right now. Ravis. Wait, 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 why? Why wouldn't it just turn? Turn, back up. That was weird. Yeah, Ravis is... Why didn't they have Ignis driving right here? Yeah, Ravis is Lady Lunafreya's brother. It's quite a weird. Oh, come on! I actually did not know you could crash this thing like that. But yeah, this thing's being done. Ravis is Lady Lunafreya's brother. Um, quite a weird predicament. Um, no clue as to why he ended up becoming a part of the Imperial Army and literally betraying Luna like that. He's got his own motives, I suppose, but still, you can't, you can't give a guy like that a pass. He makes his own choices, we all make our own choices, and he made a very bad one, apparently. I don't agree with it, but then again, this is a video game. I can't agree with everything, and uh, especially since it's a video game, it, I have no control over a lot of the stuff that actually happens here. All I have control of are these characters and what I can do with them. Can you let me pass them? So now, I haven't taken pics of whatever catches my eye, but what do you want to see? Let's get some pictures of Ignis. Get some more shots of Specs. <sighs> gotcha. I'll see what I can do. I don't see why, if he's asking Noctis a question like that, why does he get all sad when he's of anybody but Noctis? That's weird. Let's go ahead and park at the gas station because I'm not quite sure if we've actually parked there 
Uh, yes. There we go. Now I know that we can actually fast travel here. Not a big deal, though. We can always just fast travel to list all of them. So I'm not a breather. But I'd like to get all of them. But yeah, after all of that, let's go ahead and meet up with Iris. See exactly what we can figure out about what's going on right now. What's wrong? I let you down. I never made it to Kayem. The Empire came while you were gone. None of us said a word about Noct. They just showed up and then... Poor Jared. What do you mean? What happened to Jerry? There was nothing we could do! Chapter 6 A Way Forward Beneath the Cape Kayam light in the south of Klein lights an underground, lies an underground harbor. It has long served the Lucian royalty, and even now a vessel once owned by King Regis lies at anchor there, following in his father's footsteps. Noxus heads for the ship. Just for a while. 
watch out for them. Yeah, I don't want to keep Sid and Cindy waiting. They're fixing up the boat as we speak. We ought to thank them. Actually, Jared's the one we ought to thank. Yeah. He really thought of everything. Quite an emotional episode so far. Filled her up for you. Thanks. Ready to roll? Now, this says you won't be able to return for some time. Don't worry about it. Let's go ahead and pick her up. Let's get this show on the road. Morning. Who's ready to kick some ass? She seems to be in high spirits now. Now, the only thing about this is that even if you have discovered Cape Kaim, you have to do this. This is a mandatory drive right here. Luckily, they will be talking a bit, so you don't have to worry too much about. Looking at the regalia really reminds me of home. It sure doesn't look like any of the cars you see around here. And it's a lot roomier, too. I can't imagine trying to cram five people, including Gladdy, into one of those things. Have you ever ridden in one? Can't say we have. There was barely enough room for our luggage. Thank goodness you guys could give me a lift. Think the others made it to Kaim all right? I suppose we'll find out when we get there. Don't have to worry too much about it being a really quiet, boring ride over there. At least you get a little bit of lines along with it, a little bit of dialogue. And it doesn't take too, too long to get over there, to be honest. It only takes about three minutes or so. It's not too bad of a ride. So don't worry too much about it. We'll go ahead and Whoa, get over there and we'll call it you after see that? that. That's the Rock of Ravito. I'm like 90% sure. Not 100. You almost know your stuff. Oh, thanks, Jared. Jared had her almost knowing everything. <laughs> Not quite, though. But we can't, we can't bag on Jared like that. We didn't know him too well. He was only in like two of the episodes. But still, anytime you lose somebody close to the main party. <laughs> Thank you for driving, uh, Ignis. Pleasure. Are you the only one that drives? I can drive. And so can I. It's not like Iggy's the only one who can drive. He's just the only one we can trust. Wow, are they that bad? Not bad at all. Right? Right. But there's no way the big guy's taking any chances with his little sister in the car. <laughs> I can't blame him, honestly. I'd be the same way if I had a little sister and she was in the car along with me. I would make sure that she's gonna be fine. I'd, I'd be driving. I trust myself driving. Sure you don't need a break. I'm okay. You are sandwiched in back there. Have Prompto suffer instead. Really, it's fine. No suffering here. If you say so. I mean, it's not like it's a really huge ride anyways. You're only gonna be in the car like five minutes at the most. It's not too bad. One thing I do like about this ride, you do get some really good sights. I got some bad news, guys! Oh, great. Another floating fortress. Let's pull it up. Knocked. Relax. We've got this. I kind of forgot that we had to do this. Um, okay. Yeah, let's, uh, let's get on over there and take him down, I guess. Wait, we're pulling over here? Why not just pull over wherever they're at? Oh, man. Taking That's matters into hand, dumb. Delivering well, I guess you do need to leave her behind. Eurus, I'll need you to wait here. Alright. But, alright, guys. That is going to be it for today. We're gonna we're gonna be heading up there to the fortress Careful that they not. just set up. Only fools rush in. Um, next time. Review our intelligence and devise a plan. But for the time being, that's gonna be it for today. I know this ended up being quite an emotional episode. I'm sorry about that. I um. Yeah. Uh, 
I just had to get that out of my chest. Get that off my chest. I don't know, that was weight holding on to me. And then <laughs> the uh, the actual gameplay itself ended up being quite emotional. I honestly didn't plan for all that to happen. It just happened how it did. But anyways, guys, thank y'all so much for watching. And again, just pray, pray for your loved ones. If they're going through a tough time, be there for them. Do it for, not not just for my Uncle Mike and for me, but for yourselves. Thank you, guys. This has been Running With God 976. God bless y'all. I'll see y'all in the next one. Have a good one.